Hey guys, and welcome back to my channel. So today is August 6, 2019, and I move in in about two weeks from today. And I am so excited. I cannot wait. This is like, I'm so excited to move in. I cannot wait. If you guys watch any of my high school vlogs, you know that I hated high school and I was ready to go to college. I was ready to move on. So I have been counting down these days and I am so excited. So I finally have like a decent size. I'm like looking at everything over here. But I finally have like a decent sized pile of stuff that I have for my dorm. So I figured I would come on and show you everything that I have because that's pretty much all I've been doing for like the past three months is watching what everyone does and how they decorate. So, so this is kind of just going to be random. I just like, I had like a pile in another room in my house. So I kind of like moved it all into like my bedroom so I could do this video. So it's just kind of be, I'm going to pick up from the pile and then make another pile over here. So that's the kind of flow of this video. So yeah, if you guys wanna see what I got, just keep on watching. So if you guys are new here, I will be attending James Madison University, which is located in Virginia, and I will be a freshman this year. And I'm just so excited. I'm so excited, I cannot wait. Also, before I get started, I feel like that there's like, a sort of like theme that I have with my room. So me and my roommate, when we like first started talking, the first thing we talked about, we were like, all right, what are we doing with our dorm? How are we decorating? Like, what are we gonna do? We have like a pink, gray, white kind of theme going, which like, I feel like is every freshman college girl, but it's fine. So starting off with bedding, I just got this UGG Twin XL comforter set. And I don't know why I'm showing you the back, but that's what it looks like. She has like the same one, but hers is like a darker shade of pink. It's like a sun wash, like kind of like orange or like a, I don't know, darker pink. So they're both from UGG and they're both like kind of the same pattern. So this is what I had. And I think I got, I got this from Bed Bath & Beyond. So my roommate, her name is Casey. She lives around like two and a half hours away from me. And we're both around like an hour and 40 from JMU. So she came here for like a week to visit with me before like we were gonna live together. And she ordered these monograms off of Amazon and then her and I think her mom and sister painted them. So this is super cute. They're just wooden and she, I think you spray paint. So they're like this gray, which matches the rest of our room. So I think we'll either hang these like over top of our bed or like, like on the wall, like over top of our bed, like horizontally. So that is, so that is this and I love these. So if you knew me throughout high school, you know that I'm very like a visual, like artsy person. So I needed, to get like a notebook to write everything down because I hate the computer. I hate taking notes on the computer. It sucks. I love writing and I love like, yeah, whatever that means. So I picked up another, I have one. I don't know where I put it, but it's basically like a bullet journal. So you like create everything. I just get like a dotted notebook. So like this is what like a blank page would look like. So it's just blank, it's dotted. So it's easy to like make your own and like sketch whatever you want. I figured I would get one of these for college just because I'm gonna need a schedule. I'm gonna need to start, try to stay organized. Try, I don't, we'll see. But this is just a good way for me to just kind of stay organized through college and try and just remember things so I don't forget. So like, for example, for one spread, I have my class schedule with all of this and this is semester one and this is semester two. And then on the next page, I just have all of my kind of months laid out. So I can just write down like big holidays and breaks and exams. So I'm just prepared. And then I have second semester on this page. So this is something that I really like doing and like kind of getting a routine and a schedule in. So if you're a visual and like a stationary geek like me, you probably would really like one of these to have for college. So going along with my bullet journal, I also had to get a whole bunch of pens. I am literally obsessed with pens. I have, I kind of have a problem, but I mean, it's fine. I'll live. So these ones I've already started using to like write my bullet journal. And what I love about these is that they're erasable. I, I don't know what I did before an erasable pen because I'm someone that like, I just like the dark contrast on a piece of paper with like a black pen and like white paper. I hated using pencils. I, I despise it. I'd rather use a pen and cross it out rather than use a pencil. Just, 
I don't know. It was weird, but these ones are kind of like, they're kind of like a marker. Like they're not like a ballpoint pen or something. They're like a marker. So like, I really like that because they're nice and smooth. And then on top of the cap, you can erase, which is amazing. I love these and I will use these, I feel like forever. Then I just got these Paper Make Ink Joys, very basic, but these ones, they have like the capped ones, but I don't really like cap pens. I like the ones that you can like click just cause I feel like I won't lose them that often, like the caps because Lord knows it's gonna happen. And then these, all of these I got from Target, including like my notebook, but these are the Paper Mate flare pens. So this half are like the regular like bold ones. And then these ones on this side are the little skinny ones. And I absolutely love these for $10 and you get You get 18 pens for like $9.99 and I like am absolutely obsessed. These colors are just so bright. So like it's really fun to like decorate and like write in my bullet journal just cause I don't know, using a black pen's fine for like taking notes, but like when I'm drawing and decorating, I really love to use these. So I highly recommend these pens and they also don't bleed through. I'm like getting really excited, but they don't bleed through your pages. So especially in my bullet journal where the pages are like super kind of like thin, these ones are great to use cause they really don't bleed through. So going along with my whole visual stationary sort of theme, I guess, I picked up this dry erase calendar, which like I'm gonna have a calendar in my bullet journal, but it's just gonna be kind of nice to kind of have this just like sitting out always in sight so I can just fill in stuff. They had like a weekly one, so like it was kind of zoomed in on like just one week, but like I feel like I would use that more in my bullet journal. These would just be for like assignments that I know are coming up that I can just see all the time. So it'll help me remember. And then to go with the dry erase board, I also just got more markers just because colors, why not? All right, so at my graduation party, my grandmother got me, that's kind of heavy, got me a little ottoman and it's super cute. And it's like little enough where I can like slide underneath my bed and then pull it out when we have like people over and stuff so they can sit on it. But it just has my monogram on it. So it matches like the monogram that'll be above my bed. But she gave me one of these at my graduation party and it came in a set of two. So she gave me the second one like last week. She kind of stuffed it with goodies that I would need for college. So that was kind of cute. But what I also really like about these is that this part will like fold up and sit inside the lid. So if I take everything out of this and I don't need the storage, I can just fold it up and get it out of the way. So inside this, she got me some makeup sponges because I'll probably need those like a lot. I have two little like mug cakes that are pretty cute. I have a little mug. I have chapstick because everyone knows that you have to have chapstick. Also, I really like this kind of chapstick because, okay, like the other day I went and tried to get more chapstick because my sister had used my chapstick when she was sick. So I had to throw that away. So I went to get like a sun bum chapstick just cause that was her favorite. So I was like, oh, might as well try it. And it had SPF 30 in it. And I was like, oh, I'll get this. And I like always think that I'm kind of sensitive towards sunscreen. Like I always say I'm like allergic, but I just feel like every time I use it or like sunscreen, I would like break out and it was just not comfortable and I just hated it. So I try not to use a lot of sunscreen. If I do, I use like SPF eight, like something so little, but I picked up like a three pack. I, I should have gotten one, I don't know. But I picked up a three pack and I like started using it and I was like, you know, what, it'll be fine. Like I'm not allergic to sunscreen. I'm just over dramatic. And I broke out and like a rash, like all like underneath my lip and it was so gross. So I only use this type of chapstick. I use this and Laneige and that's it. But then she got me some calligraphy sets just because I like to write. And then she got me like a flip flop organizer, which I think is pretty cool. Cause you can like hang that up or something and like organize your shoes more pens and then she got me just some more notebooks so that was really nice and i love this more storage without everything having to like be in the way so i love these and i would definitely be bringing these with me okay next i feel like is pretty basic because when you go to college you obviously are gonna have a lot of space and the space you're gonna have is probably underneath your bed so for my like clothes and everything but i just got this whole big gray storage bin i guess so i can just put everything in here and have it underneath my bed and everything will be really easy to get to. And it's great, so it matches my theme, so it all works out. And then more storage, I have these two big like 
clear gray latch boxes, which like really, really standard. You know, I'm gonna need a lot of storage, so I figured why not? This will just be more to go underneath my bed. And then I have stuff stored in it now, just because I'm putting stuff in places so that not everything's random. So in here, I found this at TJ Maxx and I don't know, it's a 10 piece organizing scent. I have no clue what I'm gonna do. No idea what I'm gonna do with this, but I figured it'd be nice to have just so I can like maybe put like my makeup or my pens in like my little drawers or something. So I picked up this and notice it's pink. Me and my roommate, we obviously have a meal plan, but I figured I would pick these up from Target because they were like 70 cents, so like why not? And I just picked up two plates and two bowls. So if we need more, there's a Target like really close to campus. I just figured it'd be nice to have some dishes that we can use for any food that we have in our dorm because we probably are gonna have like snacks and stuff inside our dorm anyway, even though we do like have the dining hall super close. It's just, I just figured it'd be better to have these than not. Then I just have a thing of toothpaste, some toothbrushes, deodorant, and then I have my shampoo conditioner and I love this stuff. I love these so much, they smell so good. It's the Garnier Whole Blends. And then this is coconut water and vanilla milk extracts. It is amazing. I love this and I've been, I went through two of these and I got two more for college and I am loving these. These are like the best shampoo conditioner I've ever used and I highly recommend. They smell so good. And then when I bought my comforter set from Bed Bath & Beyond, I also just picked up these just plain white bed sheets because I got these to match everything. And then for my dorm specifically, I'm in a suite. So it's my room and then two more rooms. So it'll be six of us that have like, bed it'll be three bedrooms and then it all connects in like a, like a suite. It'll be like an inner like lounge room that we all share. And then our suite connects to another suite and that's who we share a bathroom with. So it'll be 12 girls, one bathroom, and um, I will live. But as far as the shower, I got this like shower wrap thing. So like once I like dry off, I can just put this on. So it's like a robe, but like a towel. I had one of these a while ago and I think I like lost it or something, but I love these. So I picked that up and it's gray and white. And then I also, I need another one of these anyway, but I took one out, but I got two of these little hair wraps for the shower as well. So they all match, they're all gray and white. And then as far as like dorm decorations, I really only really have the monogram. Casey also picked up one of these for me and she has a matching one, so they'll both be like 2Ks. So it's pretty cute. And I think she got this from TJ Maxx or Marshalls. So this is really cute. And then something I'm trying to do better with, especially during college, is to drink a lot of water. So I went to TJ Maxx and I found this purple Hydra Peak. And then I was cleaning out my room and found this white monogram. So I put that on there. So I think this is really cute. And I take this everywhere with me. This comes to work, this comes in the car, this comes literally everywhere. And I drink a lot more water. So highly recommend getting a nice water bottle for college. And then for my grad party, I also just got a JMU water bottle. So this will be coming with me as well. I feel like every teenage girl or like most of us, we really have like a like water bottle problem. At least me and Casey do, we notice that like we always buy them. I bought one today and my dad's like, you don't need any more. I'm like, but I really do. Like I need every single one that I have. I'm gonna be bringing a lot of water bottles, which I probably don't need and I probably shouldn't be taking, but it is what it is. And then I was at Target one day and I found this cute central perk mug and it's like, it's a really big mug and it's super cute. So, I mean, I'm gonna be needing coffee in college anyway. So I figured I'd pick this up. And then for my like two things left that I have with me that I'm bringing to college, my dad went actually went to the beach this past week. And when he goes to the beach, he like hangs flags on the house. I got a package in the mail the other day and he was like, open it and I was like, okay. And it is this James Madison little flat. Oh, it's totally backwards right now. Like, why can I read that the right way? But he got this cute little James Madison flag. So he was gonna take it with him to the beach. And I'm like, no, 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 no. I'm gonna film this video, please don't. I'm gonna bring this to college, probably just hang it up on my wall or in the lounge or something but I have to rep that school pride. And then last is something I made myself. I don't really know where I got the idea from. I kind of just like, you know what? I lied. I actually got this idea from like Redbubble. It's like a website that has like all these like cute little stickers and everything. And I was gonna get a whole bunch of stickers for my water bottle because you know, basic, but I wanted to get like a little like, they're called prints and it like has the name of the school and then it would have like everything is associated with it. And so I couldn't really find one that I liked. They were all like kind of like retro and like old fashioned and I kind of wanted like a hippie like 
red bubble one so i decided to make one myself so this is what it ended up looking like and i absolutely love this i think all the colors are just so pretty and i think it really says everything about jmu so this will be coming with me as well and will be hanging on my wall and then i've even made more of these for like my friends and everything i made like a virginia tech one app state at ecu so i absolutely love these and everyone has told me that they're really cute so i I'm absolutely in love with this. But that is everything I have with me right now for college. I also have stuff that I haven't picked up yet because I found out my dorm like a week ago or so. And I just found out my dorm doesn't have air conditioning, which like isn't a big deal for me. Like I'm fine. Like I don't really, that's not a necessity for me. I, I like, like being warm but I'm gonna get a fan. So I'm gonna get that in like a week before I go. And then my grandmother got me a Brita. So that's at her house right now. And then my roommate has the rug, our TV, no. She has the rug in the refrigerator and I have the TV. So like all that kind of stuff is kind of like the bigger items that I didn't think I was gonna show, but that is something. So right now, all I'm really looking at is I'm needing like a fan and like a shower caddy. And like, other than that, I think I'm pretty good. But also, like I've said like a million times this video, I'm such a visual person. So it's really hard for me to like pick out decor for my dorm without like seeing it first. So I think I'll probably get up there and like have like what I have with me and like hanging it up and everything and then see what I wanna do. Because when I went on a tour at JMU, they like showed us dorms, but I never got to see the one that I was gonna be staying at so I literally have no idea we'll call this a part one of my dorm haul and then I will have another one once I get there and I'll have my JMU dorm tour I'll have my JMU move-in vlog there are so many JMU videos coming and I'm so excited I cannot wait to share this with you and that is gonna be everything for this video comment down below what grade you'll be going into or what university you attend and I'll see you guys in my next video bye